Hi guys, how you doing? So we are back with another Silver Stars video on FIFA 22 and uh, it's been a few weeks so we have been treated from EA Sports since the Black Friday promo uh, with two extra Silver Star players and there's been also a couple of Silver Star players that I haven't covered with you guys yet. Uh, the team is looking very, very good. We do have six Silver Star players in the starting eleven, and a very, very strong looking bench right now. So uh, let me show you through the team. Let's go. So guys, this is the current silver team I am rocking. And as I mentioned, it is looking very, very strong right now. Uh, we have the two new silvers SBCs through the Black Friday promo in Jones and Deeney. And this Deeney card, you put a hunt on him and he becomes a 91 rated card, I believe. I will show you around here somewhere um, with what he looks like. But yeah, he's crazy. Crazy stats, like as you can see here, like attack and position, physical, like he's not getting pushed off the ball anytime soon. Uh, the speed is slacking, that's why you do put a, um, a hunter on him. Uh, but yeah, he will be taking his chances in the penalty box for sure. Phil Jones, I was hoping for a bit more speed. Uh, I did see a leak on, uh, on Twitter or TikTok and it was the cards and it had 80 pace. So I was a bit disappointed when they dropped the 73 pace, but we put a shadow on him and we're good to go. Uh, it could be worse, uh, it could be better, but he's getting in the team, he's getting in the team. And obviously we do have the uh, Emmanuel Dennis, who's been on fire recently for Watford with a few goals. Um, he is not lacking pace, 96 acceleration, 90 sprint speed, agility 95, but he's definitely a must-have in your starting 11 for me personally. And for the chemistry reasons, we've gone for Gordon left wing, but... He does actually feel very good in game. Uh, I'm not sure if you tried him yet. Let me know in the comments. But he does feel very good, um, like with his movements and uh, getting past players. Uh, I don't know why though, because obviously based on stats, he doesn't look amazing. Uh, but he he does feel good. He feels better than Olsen. Like Olsen, he's hit and miss for me. He's um, obviously agility is slacking a little bit. Uh, so I do think you should play him up front and not on the wings. Um, so in game, I'll probably be playing him and Dini up front and then I'll play Dennis and Gordon just behind on the uh, wings. Um, then we do have, obviously, uh, for the chemistry reasons, Ichubo with a full green link there. Um, I've mentioned this guy previously, I think, in my first Silver Star video. The Nigerian squad, a very, very good all-round card uh, for that defence midfield position. Great stamina, great agility. Um, and yeah, just a good, good, solid midfielder, really. And again, for the chemist reasons, we have uh, Spanberg, who is a bit more attacking uh, than Ichubo, um, with the 62 defending. But box to box midfielder, he's, he will do. He, he's not the worst silver guard, and he's not the best silver guard. But if it means we get another silver star player into the starting lineup, we'll go with it. We'll go. But I'm, I am looking forward to hopefully a few good midfielders in the coming weeks because obviously we've got a lot of left wingers here look left backs full backs left wingers like we had one two three we've had four left wingers out of what uh four five six seven eight yeah like nearly half the silver stars are left wingers so i'm hoping we get a couple good solid midfielders like box to box or holding midfielders soon uh so we can like try and get them into the team um but for now we can bring in tecker on for that position um obviously he was a striker when he came out but with the semi defending and so solid all-round stats you can play him in that box-to-box -box position uh and obviously then we have the custom tactics so i don't play that formation that's for chemistry reasons only i am rocking the 4-2-2-2 and as i mentioned here we're going to swap this around we're going to go for dennis and gordon on the wings olsen dini up front with the holder midfielders are tubo and spamberg and then obviously the pace in uh, Henry and uh, the Silver Star Leon on the wings. And again, Kakaros in the centre center defence spot with Phil Jones himself. Um, but normally I have like balance or like direct passing. I, I do change this quite a bit at the moment. I don't know what's best. Since a few updates ago, I do feel like the game has changed pretty, quite dramatically. And I feel like a lot more players and teams, uh, opponents... So I say are dropping deeper and deeper. 
not sure that's the same for you guys. Let me know how you've been getting on since like they, they keep updating and patching the gameplay. Um, but yeah, we're just going to put that direct pass in for now. So obviously Silver Stars is a lot of uh, golden goals and people leave. So we want to be um, up for the fight from the first from the kickoff. So yeah, what we'll do now, we'll have a, a quick game. Show you how the, the, the team runs in game and a few highlights. And yeah, hopefully you enjoyed the video. Let me know what teams you are running right now. I am curious to see um, what I'm doing wrong. If you think I should be playing someone like Sulemana, who I do rate highly, which I will be bringing on straight away in game um, for someone. like He will make an appearance each game. Uh, I do rate him highly. And also Jota is very good as well, to be fair. The 96 agility, 90 acceleration and 94 sprint speed. So hopefully you guys have done the Silver Stars each week because these two are very good to have uh, as options. And then we have obviously the Thiago Giallo, uh, 83 pace, solid defender on the bench, just in case one of these guys gets sent off and we have to sacrifice a forward player for a defender. And then we have obviously Krishna, who I've said previously in my previous videos how good he is as a silver striker, probably the best silver striker uh, based on like overall stats. But yeah, what we'll do, we'll jump into some gameplay now. And don't forget, if you haven't already, please right now click the subscribe button give me a thumbs up and give me a comment as well it does all help me massively and it will make me obviously release more videos for you guys and let me know what videos you want from me do you want more gameplay do you want more reviews or uh, do you want me to go through your teams and say what i would improve let me know in the comments cheers we've got three silver stars left back center forward and teke and the right winger is it Olsen? Olsen? I always forget his name. Olsen or Olsen? One of those. Oh, he's poor, isn't it? Is he leaving the game? He's seen my team and he's shivering. He's scared. He is scared. Double check my... Get into box. Get into box. Free roam. Free roam. He's not leaving. We got a game. We got a game. Let's do it. I've not got any uh, music on here or commentary. I feel like it's very quiet without it. Go. Let me know in the comments. Do you do you play the commentary or do you have music on instead? I would have music on, but obviously with YouTube, I don't want them to uh, copyright me, so I have muted the music. So it does just seems too quiet. I don't think I like it like this. I might have to put the commentary on just for this this game. I feel like I'm playing a whole different game about the uh the music and that. Let me put the commentary on. Able to change your mind, but he wasn't right, here we go. And that's a poor pass. Commentary's back. What's that center back doing? Tebo, Dennis, who's that run? Around the outside. Oh, he blocked the he blocked the run there. Tebo. Oh. I'll track back. Easy. Why is my centre back doing that? What a pass but to Olsen. Well, Do you know what? Olsen doesn't it. doesn't feel great, you know. Like compared to like Soddy Manor. So I just feel like he turns like a truck. Able to keep the ball. Oh no. Loose pass there. Got to do better. Got to do better. Karim Adeyemi. It might be on for them. Another successful intervention. Winning the ball. Spangberg interception. Now on the attack. Look for Dennis. 
Use that pace. Go, go, go. Good technique displayed. Easy, easy. All but the finish. All but the finish. Well, I'm not surprised he missed that. He never really looked in complete control, did he? Belgarde. Randy and Tekka. Jean-Victor Belgarde. Now, what can the Royals do from this position? Okay. We've got some uh, momentum going forward here in this attack. And it didn't last long. Quinn Olsen. Making progress. Oh my Olsen. That's why I didn't have my chess and tactics on. I don't balance like a what a muppet. Zini. Can he give them the there we go. There we go. Change it to my tactics. We score straight away. Well, that was a fairly Mate, it's crazy what formations and custom tactics it. do. You won't find how they come, though. Well, back underway here. Is there to be a response from the Royals? There needs to be. Right, we should just put this guy to bed now. He's got the right formation and right tactics. Let's just, uh, let's just full send it. Let's finish the guy. Well, possibilities inside the box. Easy, easy. How long we send? How many goals does this guy leave, do you reckon? Predictions? Well, a second goal for them here. Right. Hard driven pass. Little touch to his right foot. Bottom right corner. And possession lost. Intercepted. So what can they do to stop him running at them? Zini. Oh, what a shot that Zini test out that shooting ability. Well, as you can see, the host have controlled the possession and as a result have dominated the game. Some of their passing movements have been a joy to watch and I don't think anything's going to change that. Well, in the crowd, they want to see him take on the job. Beanie out-muscles the defender, gets a yard, cross the goalkeeper with power. You're not, you're not saving that. 3-0, see you later. Easy. Easy as that, guys. This team... Is unbeatable. I tell you. Unbeatable.